Hi, Senator Chris Mason on DE. Well, today we have a little Honda crankshaft on our lathe, and we're, we've been asked to uh, knife edge this thing. And one of the problems that we've run into here, of course, is the steel balls, which are pressed in here. We've got, uh, I think we've got most of them out. Uh, yeah, we just got one left to do here. I want to show you how to do this. This isn't uh, terribly difficult, but uh, it is kind of a pain in the butt. Of course, the biggest problem here is the fact that you have a convex surface and you can't drill into this. So what we have to do is we have to make a flat spot on it. And to do that, I'm taking a four flute end mill and uh, we're going to take and flatten out this surface here enough to where we can get in there and spot face it with a punch and then we'll use a uh, centering tool to uh, try and drill this out. Now that we've got a reasonably flat surface on there, we can go ahead and take our punch and we're just using center punch here. And you want to try and approximate the same angle as the hole is drilled in the crank. Alright, so now we got a place for our center drill to go into. And uh, we'll see if we can get this out. All right, get the senior kind of punched hole. I've got a hole there. And there we are. So we went from here all the way down to this hole in the main, and it's a larger hole, so any swore for any chips that we've got that's come out from our drilling process is going to come out of here. And you always want to drill all the way through so that you make sure that you get everything cleaned out. Anyway, this is just one of the ways you can take and get the uh, steel balls out of your crank. Uh, if you have any questions, give me a call at Coast Base R&D. We'll see you soon.